Lesson number five. Perseverant is about not giving up. What's your story behind perseverance is not about giving up? Again, I learned this in boxing. So I, I lost my first fight and wanted to give up right away. And my coach was like, come on, champ. You have natural abilities. Don't give up, champ. You could do this. And so he convinced me. I, I fought again. And I lost again. And this time I was like, Shorty, I really want to give up. There's nothing fun about this intense fear I feel. Then I lose. Then I start crying and I'm humiliated. I, I, I said, I just don't want to do this anymore. And then he was like, come on, champ. Don't be a quitter, champ. You could, you could become a champ. And he was right. You know, I ended up continuing on and became the seven-time national champion and uh, was on the rise to, the, to make it to the Olympics in Barcelona, Spain in 1992. I ended up losing in Barcelona, Spain, and I was shattered. My dreams are shattered. I was no longer going to win that gold medal. I wasn't going to go to Barcelona, Spain. I wasn't hearing from those big-time promoters. But I kept on. Six months later, I fight the same guy that robbed me of my Olympic dreams. And this time I knocked him out in the first round for the U.S. championship. But by not giving up early on in my boxing career, I benefited so much from boxing. So I got to have this global perspective. Here I am. I'm representing the United States of America national boxing team. There's a lot of responsibility and prestige behind that. And so I remember going to Poland. I had, I brought my own biases in Poland because I thought the Polish people were going to be racist because I was bullied by a racist person. So that wasn't true. So obviously that, that global perspective, all of the virtues I learned in the sport of boxing would have never happened if I would have given up. And the other point I wanted to share here, if I can, Please. is that generally speaking, we're so afraid of failure. And I think that's a big mistake. I think because we're so afraid of failure, many are not reaching our full potential. And so failure can be a critical thing in your life that could lead you to become a better person, uh, become more resilient, and, and ultimately a be better leader. I think if you're never failing in life, you might be taking it too easy and not challenging yourself enough.